There's been a lot of talk in the media about there being heavy metals in this sludge. What, what does that mean and why is that a problem? Well, heavy metals are those really from iron downwards. I mean, iron and beyond on the periodic table. Some of these, like cadmium and mercury, are really quite poisonous. Iron is not poisonous. Titanium dioxide is used in white paint. Probably, as you watch this, you're sitting in a room with the walls painted with titanium dioxide. So the chemical danger in this case is genuine, but not as serious as in some other chemical spills that have occurred in the past. And by and large, the chemical industry is extremely good, and it is very rare that you get large releases of chemicals into the environment, which is why when one of these releases occurs, either from mineral processing or from chemical processing, that people get so worried because it doesn't happen very often and because when it does, it's quite a problem to clean it up. Why is it a problem when a river or water becomes alkaline? Everything that lives in the river, fish, insects, plants are <clears throat> live there because they have adjusted to the conditions in the environment. In fact, the conditions in a river tend to be much more stable than in air because if you live in the air, sometimes it's hot, sometimes it's cold, but in a river the temperature doesn't change so much. And similarly, the alkalinity of the river is quite stable. Some st rivers are quite acid if they've gone across peat soil. Others are rather more alkaline and the fish and the wildlife reflects accordingly. But the real thing is that it's partly the way that fish and other um, <clears throat> water creatures breathe because they breathe by passing large amounts of water over their gills. And so even quite small quantities of chemicals can become concentrated in them. Of course, the same is true when you breathe air in your lungs, but the concentration of chemicals in water can be much higher than the concentration of chemicals in the air. And so it doesn't get diluted nearly as rapidly.